Are you aware of the latest innovations in data orchestration and machine learning? Join me as I chat with Andreas Wesselman about the trends, challenges and how to modernize your data management strategy. Hi Andreas, you have an extensive experience in data management. Can you share your experience over the past 10 years, how you've seen this domain evolving? I think there are two main drivers in the last 10 years. The one is the massively increasing complexity of the landscape by the sheer amount of data that is growing, but also the variety of data and the different technologies that are coming up and streaming data and standard data and relational data. So to manage that, that complexity is a key issue. And at the same time, there is a pressure to faster get value out of the data because at the end of the day, what the customers want is really to get insights in the business and to get value out of the data. And what type of new developments you see right now to solve these type of problems? I think we are now at a phase where technology, for example, if I take the machine learning capability, is at a phase where it really can be productized and used at the customer. So the GPU power and that stuff is available, so it's really up on prime time for productization. So you need an environment that helps you to transition also your existing environment and take this with you and then leveraging the assets and complementing that with the insights that you gain via machine learning capabilities, for example. So I know quite some companies who want to transform to this new type of solutions. What steps should they take? Uh, mostly I would recommend that you first think big, but start small. So start with a very concrete thing where you get immediate business benefits, where you show really the business value and not just a technical product and not make the mistake to discuss a big theory for five years and then at the end there's only less outcome. Andreas, thanks a lot for sharing your extensive experience and thank you for watching.